is a question people have been asking me how to build up patience in this messy world that if you say anything people get very angry our relatives our friends are also the same we do not know when to open our mouth <laughs> yes the patience is not something that you practice like you go and you learn by heart just because you want to pass examination and then you forget it doesn't get imprinted in every cell of your brain it doesn't become a way of life hence all the schooling and the colleges what you study have become rotten and you have forgotten patience builds up from the understanding of your family <clears throat> the moment the culture the samskriti of the house is broken at present you think it is not broken because you are non stop in touch with you because you have whatsapp you have created a whatsapp group of your team of your parents of your friends of your relatives etc but that is artificial you must understand there are two ways one is this is the good touch and the bad touch but the reality is there no such good touch and bad touch the child i was sitting and kaviyarasi was uh, one and a half years two and a half years she crawled 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 and she came to me and she climbed home and uh, chandrashekhar naik the pre university joint uh, director was sitting he said who oh, i can't believe they have so much of freedom to climb home <laughs> we do not feel it is a freedom it's a way of life in the in our system in every house it's a way of life when you sit with your family when you talk and you joke and you have food together take bath together then anything uh, father says mother says brother says sister says nobody is offended because they know at least uh, they have expressed something they never used the term they were scolding they never used the term him say torture so sitting together is strength it can create healthiness or a lot of health also uh, flows in this uh, journey recently in rakum school in devanali we had uh, buses running our buses were stopped because of cost involved so we booked chartered buses two chartered buses each chartered bus will come to 70000 to 75000 per month so it is around 1 and 1/2 lakhs we are paying to bring the village children free of cost to the school previously we are sending our school buses then in one area the one bus was itself was running so we thought why should we uh, book the chartered bus we can utilize that bus is regular bus it been this is run so we are running and then the the depot manager said okay you can take passes we took passes it was very good suddenly the bus stopped after 5 6 months so when we requested them what what happened just we are asked what happened The, uh, they get very angry and they stop the total buses running over here we can't even ask why because we have written a letter to the shantinagar uh, traffic controller we have written to the chief minister the transport minister <laughs> telling why the buses because buses are meant for 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 the people's good and we we have taken yearly passes it's their duty they don't even think it is their duty it's just anger anger is war it's not even ordinary war it's war they become the russia and we become the ukraine bombarding day in and day out to destroy totally out that will destroy everybody is yes. when you look at the sky in spit at the sky to whom does the spit falls patience building why we don't have patience because the 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 schooling and the university studies is bombarded children and given everything right in front of them if you don't have answers there is always uh, guides guide books this book that book everything is available for the answers are right available so nobody goes deeper nobody wants anything to be seen a deep like the um, uh, other other uh, 11th standard girls from other schools came to do seva over here then i said okay you can go to the first floor my girls are there they are giving bath to the baby children and all 
this girl went up and they came, come back uh, uh, giggling and laughing. I said, why? First time they're seeing baby children <laughs> without clothes, they're giving bath. And the, they have got disconnected. Everything is covered and covered, which they see only through the, uh, through the mobile and other things. You must come out of that. You must sit. Please switch off your mobile and just sit next to the father and mother. You build up your patience. You, you do not have to go anywhere to build up patience. Patience is the God of patience. Is you yourself become God on, on your daily life by not practicing but being. Practicing and being is very important. When you go to the gym, you get powerful muscles. But that muscles goes the moment you stop and you will be forced to stop because it is an artificial area. But when you do your work right in your own land, it's a regular feature that you can put the seed, the plant grows, you dig the, you use the spade, you use the pickaxe, you climb the tree, you pluck the fruits, you don't buy the fruits from the market. You can see a beautiful body. That beautiful body is called patience. That beautiful body Patience, they say truth is bitter, but fruits are sweet. Here, patience is bitter, but the fruits are sweet. The patience of trying to be with the people, trying to talk to the people. You have got disconnected talking to the people. Sometimes husband and wife sit next to next next to each other and still they message. They don't even really talk. Talking is very important. The industrial revolution has created people, disconnected people from the reality of life. Hence, there is a lot of anger, anger on the tip of the iceberg. I only pray this problem, which has been created in Rajan Kunde bus depot at the Bangalore Metropolitan uh, BMT's Transport Corporation. They should extend help and make sure that the other two uh, chartered buses also they run uh, the regular buses in that route also because they are getting around 50, 100 students in that locality. The government doesn't run buses where hundred children are all, every day, hundred people, morning and evening. There are buses which are running empty. But here in Rakum School, buses are filled up. It's not about anger. It's about trying to build up patience. If you don't build up patience, then you go to astrologers and they say, you got the curse from Guruji, you got the curse. There's no curse in the curse. is because you're not talking. You're not trying to understand. Rakum School is run on free. Everything is free, which we take it from the public and we immediately distribute to try to tell the people distribution is health. And we were being an example, not only to the children, but to the elderly people also. Patience, the God of patience, practice by sitting next to your parents. You build up a lot of health. Health is wealth. And in the health and wealth, you find good friends and good relatives. Through that, you can connect uh, a strong family. Family is joint family. Joint family leads you to the family tree. That connecting link is God.